anticipating a new year here in 2019 as you're getting ready for fall camp. What feels different this season? You've been around here for a few years now, obviously, in Bloomington. What feels different about 2019? I think just our outlook and our mentality, um, just the way we've been attacking the weight room, um, the way player-led practices have gone, the way that leaders are stepping up and embracing their role um, as leaders on the team. So I think um, obviously it starts from the top down with coaches, but I think the leaders are doing a good job of uh, communicating to their uh, specific position groups. What goals and challenges did you make for yourself from the end of last season through the summer off-season workouts and, and obviously getting ready for camp? Yeah, I think that leadership role that I just talked about was one thing that I really wanted to focus on and, and something that I've been a lot better at and, and communicating and correcting and criticizing um, and not being afraid to kind of step outside of my comfort zone. Um, so that's one thing that I think I've developed and gotten better at. And then from an on-field perspective, I think just uh, my footwork and, and uh, being more accurate with the ball and, and, and timing are the things that I've been working on and I've gotten better at this summer. What's the process been like as you've worked with Coach DeBoer coming in, changing up the plays, and then now with him running the show on offense, uh, what's changed from your perspective? Yeah, I mean, obviously it's a little bit different in terms of verbiage and how we communicate things, but um, there's only so many so many football plays and so many ways to get guys in, um, in, in different spots. So uh, really it's just learning the communication, learning how to, how to talk different and um, the football plays, you know, they just they fall into place because it's you're, you're just out there playing. How much is the competition, whether it's everybody fighting a position group, quarterback room is no different. How much does that inner competition drive you just to be the best quarterback and the best quarterback for Indiana? Yeah, I think competition is definitely important, but um, I'd say my outlook on competition is a little different. I just try to you know focus on myself every single day and, and not not get too caught up in what's going on, and um, you know that way there's no there's no outlying. Uh, you know, things that are, that are you know, egging on and, and you're thinking about. So I, I just try to uh, think about myself, focus on myself every single day and, and get better.